you guys. Welcome to the Being Beautifully Honest podcast and channel. Thanks for being here and for being subscribed. And if you're not, go ahead and hit that button. If you're listening on YouTube, hit that like button. It's like walking in the room and hitting that light switch. Let's brighten up the place and get into this reality chat. I just thought this was so funny. I, I wanted to share this and talk about it with you guys real quick. All right, so courtesy of What's Happening YouTube channel, I'll have a link to the full video in the description box. But Carlos, he was doing a live from what he calls his clothes, <laughs> which to me, honestly, is a little bit funny because just to share something funny with you guys, I don't really do a videos on this channel. It's more podcast style. But I'm actually in my, if you want to call it clothes, I do have an office and a studio but when I'm recording my podcast, I like to do them in my closet because I just feel like the acoustics are better and where I am surrounded by sometimes there's a lot of noise. And anyway, I just thought that was kind of funny. I never mentioned that before. Not that you guys care, <laughs> but just some unuseful information. But let's just go ahead and talk about this because as we know, Hotel, he went on a tirade saying, you know, if love and marriage Huntsville wants to keep him on they need to show his real life and he was just so upset that he was exposed for wanting melody and then he wanted to say no I didn't I didn't want her back I don't want her back which is a lie but anyway and actually not a lie he doesn't really want her back he wants what came with her back but anyway Carlos, he was doing a live from his office, and somebody asked him about Hotel and he had a response and I thought it was a little funny. So let's just go ahead and talk about this. Which one of those shoes you're going to put your foot to kick Martel off your show? <laughs> I will be addressing the Martel comment on my podcast tour with Melody. Don't worry. I'll address it. On live in person. If you don't got your tickets, get them, baby. Me and Melody Cherie, January 21st. Okay. I'll be addressing Mr. Holt then. Yes, honey. Yes. Let me tell y'all something. <clears throat> I don't know. I know. Don't bring me down. I know Special K. We're not going to talk about that. I already addressed it. It's all good. Thank you, Rain Drops, for having my back. Because what we do over at the kingdom is reality. I don't listen. Don't get mad at me because your reality ain't what you want it to be, baby. I I, I show up and work. People mad at me because other people mad at them for what they say. And it's my fault. But we'll get to that Sunday, January 21st in Huntsville, Alabama at my live show with Melody. All right. So you heard what he had to say. And <laughs> I mean, of course, he's going to try to sell those tickets. I don't know if they're ever going to show clips of the live show because it would be nice to hear if he addresses it, how he is going to address it. But he said he's going to. So we'll see. But it's it, it's the God's honest truth. Carlos may not be one of my favorite people for different reasons, but when it comes to this hotel situation, and like he said, don't get mad at me because people are saying things that you don't like, and it's your reality. And, you know, and basically calling him out to say, there's nothing fake over here. Don't sit and put everyone else in the same boat that you're in because you're not wanting to be accepting of what your reality is or even really wanting to share what's real. And when you do, then you get mad when you get shut down and you get rejected. The reality is he wants the life and the lifestyle back that he had with Melody and Mel is never going back there because she shot him down and said that there will never be any peace. There will never be any grace. He's mad about it today and mad that other people are calling. I won't even say calling him out on it. He was so ridiculous. He responded to a comment that did not speak to him directly. 
Erica Mena made a comment under Carlos's post and she did not at Hotel Holt. She just wrote the comment and his psychotic, you know what, is just strolling through the comment section and decided that he couldn't take it anymore and he was going to respond to that and saying, fire me if you're not going to show my reality. No one wants to see your reality. No one wants to see you anymore. Goodbye. Go and work at Lowe's or Home Depot. I don't know how many times I have to say that. So I just wanted to share that because I thought it was interesting. And it <laughs> he didn't lie. Carlos didn't say anything that wasn't true. Even though he did not directly address Hotel, we know exactly who he was speaking to and what he was speaking about, Okay. So guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Thanks for being here, for liking and subscribing. I'm Beth, just being beautifully honest. So until the next time, I just wanted to keep it brief, beautiful. And now I'm going to say bye.